Diddy has been sued a third time for alleged SA, and this time a third person is allegedly involved. The new lawsuit obtained by TMZ was filed anonymously by Jane Doe, who claims Diddy and singer-songwriter Aaron Hall took turns assaulting her and one of her friends, either in 1990 or 1991. The lawsuit alleges the woman and her friends met Diddy at a record event, and Diddy and Hall began flirting with them, buying them drinks during the evening. The woman claims Diddy and Hall took the woman to Hall's apartment, where she was offered more alcohol and then coerced into having sex with Diddy. She says she was traumatized and then as she lay in the bed, Hall allegedly came in, pinned her down, and assaulted her. She says her friend was also assaulted by both men, allegedly. She says a few days later, Sean Combs went to the woman's home and became enraged. He was irate and began assaulting and choking Jane Doe to the point that she passed out. Combs was searching for Jane Doe's friend because he was worried that she would tell the girl he was with at the time what he and Hall had done to them, allegedly. The New York lawsuit, first reported by Rolling Stone, claims she went to doctors and told her, fam her family and friends about what happened. And as you know, what happened last week, Cassie filed a lawsuit against Diddy, and it was settled a day after. And she was alleging, among other things, assault and human trafficking. The case settled the day after it was filed for an undisclosed amount. And I'm reading the TMZ article. It says here, as for the second lawsuit, a rep told them this last minute lawsuit is an example of how a well-intentioned law can be turned on its head. It is saying that Miss Dickerson, 32-year-old story, is made up and not credible. Mr. Combs never assaulted her, and she implicates companies that did not exist. This is purely a money grab and nothing more, according to this TMZ article. So, you know, this doesn't look good for Didi. I don't know what's gonna happen here but do you guys believe this is true do you think it's a money grab or do you believe that all these things actually did happen so they have this act it's called the adult survivors act in new york state the act was passed in 2022 and it was created it created a year-long window where those statues of limitation could be lifted, where women could file these lawsuits. So now it has ended. So these women did file the lawsuit within that time frame. So what do you think? Do you think Diddy really did this? Tell me your opinion. <laughs>